Let's keep exploring. What does this say? Goron Racetrack ahead. Closed for winter. Oh, uh, okay. Explains what's out there. Ow, my ass. Thanks, Bender. You like Bender. Who doesn't like Bender? Bender rules. One punch, bitch. One punch! Guess you can call me Saitama. Cause I'm a fucking loser. <laughs> and I'm broke. Wait, I have a question. Okay. Hey, Nice. Where the fuck did it open? Good question. Alright, I need a rap sheet of neutral responses here. Oh, you... Ha <laughs> <Stop getting hurt. laughs> Eat it. Hey. Wanna hear the most annoying sound in the world? Oh man, this is my jam. Baby's crying? No, I meant the, the the bongo music. Yes, I do enjoy the screams of children. Did I ever tell you? Okay, so I, I work in a hotel, right? So, this reminds <laughs> that transition. me- transition. I enjoy the screams of children. Did I ever tell you? I work in a hotel, and there's a- there, I work near a hallway, and the hallway shares a wall with our pool. Okay. There's a there's like a slide in the pool. So what happens is the wall's just thin enough that if peep if the kids are like playing around and they're having fun and they're like they're like shrieking at one another, you can hear it really echoed through that wall when you walk through that hallway. So every once in a while I'll be traveling through that hallway and I'll just hear like the ghostly wails of children like distorted off of water surface. It's fucking awesome. It's That's it terrible. shrieks of joy. Oh, wait. stupid. What? What are you doing? This is a ramp. Yeah. I'm figuring shit out. Yeah. I have to go off all spiky mode, and it's really hard to get spiky mode. Mm -hmm. You can't just activate fucking spiky mode. Yeah. I have to gain just enough momentum. That's fair. And if it doesn't work, that's fine. I just... Yeah, you kind of need, like, a straight line. <gasps> Second day. Two days left. <laughs> child is still screaming. I'll be impressed if you can pull that off. Nice. Are you impressed? Yeah. Unfortunately, it's not, it didn't get what I wanted. I didn't hit it. I fucking... Yeah. Too bad it's so darn hard to aim. Yeah, it's probably not the way I'm supposed to do it either. Probably supposed to go in here and then... Oh, I assume this is a loading zone. Yeah, that is a completely reasonable thing to assume. What? Oh my god, the what? stop. The daddy, daddy. I'm cold, daddy. Dormy, where's my daddy? Where's my daddy? And... Oh, the fucking kid, I swear. Daddy! Yeah, 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 Where's yeah. my daddy? My daddy's gone. Yeah. Got him. Hey. Alright, let's try talking to people. Nermani, sure. you're alive. The Goran Elder said you died. Was that a lie? Whatever the case may be, welcome back. So, does that incessant crying sound familiar to you? The Goran Elder's son won't stop crying. What? Your Darmani? That I is that crying getting to me? That is my eyes playing tricks on me? This keeps up, I'll really go crazy. You know, me and my brother are always hanging out 
waddling in unison. The store's having trouble because of getting product because of the cold. Things are kind of expensive now, so you shouldn't shop here. I wonder if you talk to him as a normal Link, he'll be like, Hey, a tourist! Come on, shop! Please! Yeah, let's try it. Fucking asshole. I wonder if the dialogue's different. Store's having trouble getting products. Things are cool. Oh, that's nice of him. You know, but is he racist towards Deku? <laughs> it's like... Hey, Deku Scrub, prices are are half right now. Go on in. We can't just automatically assume everybody's racist. No, that's why we have to test it. We need a litmus test for the racism. Always make sure to... I'm thinking about how many different ways this joke could go. Okay, we're going to stop it short. Yeah, high five. Ah, that was loud. Well, this is a rare sight. Welcome. Push left to right. Blah, blah, blah. Who cares? 80 rupees. Jesus Christ. Dude, I can go in the bushes and get that shit. Oh, look. Rocks. Can't get those anywhere. Oh, no. It reset. Chain. Yeah. I'm fucking stupid. What? Give me a second. Oh, he's working. He's gaming. He's doing it. He's doing it. He's doing it. He's doing it well. Oh no. The pots. They're too big. Fuck. <laughs> just chop the chandelier, just kill everybody <laughs> below. <laughs> Perish, Gorons. First you were psychologically tormented, now you're physically crippled. What is, is it, what this guy's selling? The other guy sold magic beans. Thanks for stopping by. I'm doing business with a focus on Goron clientele. And that, sir, makes you a customer. Right now I've got a special trading offer just for you. I'll give you my biggest bomb bag, regularly priced at a thousand rupees. Return, you give me your big bomb bag, and just give me two hundred rupees. Do you need any? You don't have a big bomb bag. I can't sell it to you. We don't even have the big bomb bag. Yeah. We've just got that stinky regular bomb bag. Hey, it's Tingle. What's up, Tingle? I like I like how you're tingling. Remember when Tingle came in the seam and he, he tingled all over the place? No, I don't. Because I tried to forget him. The great tingling? Oh boy, did it not work. Hmm, he's not in the same spot. Or maybe he's just dead. I'll find him. Aha, the big one, of course. <laughs> Look at this frozen asshole. God damn, dude. Get a coat. Huh? What was I doing? Uh, it's already this late. I must hurry. No matter how long you follow me, it's not gonna do you any good. What? My son's crying because he misses me. Why do you know that? My son misses me. Oh, forgive me, my child. Your father has work to do. Darmani, be you a ghost or a figment of my imagination, I no longer care. You feel pity for my crying son. Kill him. <laughs> Put him out of his misery. <laughs> Kill the child. Corrupt them all. <laughs> <laughs> then, then please, <laughs> then please quietly sing my song to sleep with this song I'm about to play on my drum. I'm about to go sicko mode. He just starts playing like Metallica. Very same melody that was often played for you when you were young. 
Here we go. Uh, let me play it once more. Um, ah, uh, yeah, this way. Uh, it's no good. I can only remember the beginning. Shit. Here's the beginning, I guess. Hooray, we did it. We got old man dementia. All about you. It's sad. You learned the lullaby intro. It's fucking useless. The soothing melody of a thoughtful father. Who keeps walking in circles and freezing. That's a pity. It's not that I forget it. It's just so cold I can't play it very well. Oh. Well, now I just look like an asshole. At any rate, I'm counting on you. Well, sh shit. <laughs> what a fucking asshole. What? Wait. Wait. It made the wolf go away. Wonder if it's just because I pulled out the instrument and it. It played the. the the tune as though it did something, though. The thing. Yeah. Weird. Cool. Well, I mean, the Song of Healing can heal signs, right? So I wonder if the lullaby can also put enemies to sleep. Maybe. Interesting. I wonder if it does. Or I wonder if uh, I'm full of shit. I don't know. I could be both. Don't worry, child. I will soothe you. Your father has told me to put you to sleep. Forever. That song. That's the song Daddy always plays for me before I go to sleep. I'll sing the next part. Oh. Huh. It's more than six. Yeah. Yeah. Babongo da dongo. Just like daddy's, right beside me. <sighs> nice. The Goron, or the lullaby intro became the Goron lullaby. This lullaby blankets listeners in calm while making eyelids grow heavy. Oh, we, oh God, we've cursed them to eternal sleep. Like fucking Rip Van Winkle. Ha! Bye ya! Star Moni! You were always good at calming the Elder Sun. Now, the next thing we have to do is something about the torchlights in this room. Oh, right, because it's cold. Yeah, I guess that makes sense. What? The crying stopped, but there's still something wrong with my eyes. He's supposed to be dead. Yeah, I see Star Manny standing right before my own eyes. It, it is you. 
You can have the food I hid in the chandelier up there, so please, just die in peace. <laughs> I think that was supposed to be more respectful than it came off as, but... Please okay. just die in peace. Please die! There's food in the chandelier? What? I left an emergency stack, uh, snack in the chandelier. You know, like a normal person. What the fuck am I supposed to get that? Good question. I guess we'll just have to figure it out. Oh hey, the rest of them woke up. Like some sort of puzzle. Yeah. I guess you can only hit the one in front. Yeah. The way it is right now. Hmm. Hmm? Oh. Oh? Oh. 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 Yeah. Oh. Fuck that pillar. Fuck that pillar. Don't, don't fuck the pillar. Fuck that torch. Fuck that rock. Fuck that carpet, I think. Yep. It, I mean, it's a flat texture, but it, it looks like a carpet. Why would you want to fuck it? Really trying to assert dominance over a carpet? Well, I mean, uh, to be fair, out of all the things that Gorads could fuck... I mean, they could fuck just about anything in this room, to be fair. Yeah. They could even fuck... Building blocks. And fire. And pot. I have no fucking idea what to do with any of this information. I got it. Yeah. Fire. There's the stick. <laughs> nice. You do that thing that, like, everybody does when they first start using Deku Sticks, where they're ro running around the wrong side. What do you mean? What, so you have to be on the right side of them to light them? Yeah. Oh, fuck me. What? They're going out. What? Yes. Nah, you got this. I was... It's this... just, it's just like optimizing the path perfectly. Stick one out in like five seconds back in the last dungeon. Yeah, fucked up, wasn't it? That's why I assumed the stick hey. would just. All right. Got him. That's why I just assumed the stick would go out immediately. I guess not. That's fucking I... weird. Yeah, what is up with that? It did go out super fast. Yeah. Oh, you know what? It's probably the butterflies. Or moths. I don't know why I kept calling them butterflies. They're clearly, they're almost certainly moths. I think the moths being on your stick was causing it to go out faster. Nice. Do I need to break all of them for some reason? Break the targets. That took me a second. I'm like, why did that sound familiar? It's like, oh, yep, yep. Did I get it pretty close? Uh, pretty close. The cadence was pretty right. I don't- I don't have, like, a Xander Mobus voice, but I can do a little bit of that. Duck Hunt! The what now? I love in- in Smash Ultimate when he says the- the character Duck Hunt. He- he takes a power gap between the two words. He has to. He has to, so he goes, Duck Hunt! <laughs> because they know. That was probably an explicit instruction from Nintendo. Yeah. Because we're all five years old when you get right down to it. It's also funny that there's like the memes where it's like, oh yeah, the Smash announcer is giving preferential treatment to certain people. It'll be like, Mario! Link! There's the food. Zelda! Ganondorf! I know what to do with the food. That's a- this is a rock. It is a rock. These little waddle locks. I have to locks. carry this all the fucking way back there. Hell yeah, you do. Hey. Okay. I got it. That's it. It's so good that I dream about it. The Dongo Cavern's finest quality rock sirloin. You did it. This is my absolute favorite. I'm gonna eat it now. 
Oh, my energy has returned to me. I actually missed the rock when I ate it. I just ate part of my feet. <laughs> I'm coming down now. Wait one moment. Wow, that was hard. Damn, dude. Oh, I wondered who it might be. Why, if it isn't Darmani, you are alive? Yes, I see. That's the reason why you knew my favorite food. Uh-huh. It's the only food we had. We also... Uh, also, we didn't ask him for food. He no, didn't he... ask us for food this time. Uh, no, I... And he did. No, oh, we rolled by him, yeah. Do you like how he's wearing a uh, frog as a hat and the frog has hair growing out of it? Yeah. It's creepy. I like that. I like how we're having opposite reactions to these things constantly. Oh, I almost forgot. Please accept this as a token of my gratitude. Yeah, you got Don Garrow's mask. It looks just like Don Garrow, conductor of the Frog Choir. It's crafted so well that no one would even Finally. think... Finally! If you were to direct the Frog Choir... Finally, I can do stuff with the frogs! Yeah, Frog Choir. I've been asking about the frogs for, like... Since we started. Yeah, now we can do frog crime. I hope that the spring will come soon so that we can hear the frog's enthusiastic performance. Hope as I might, it's still cold. I'm going back to Goron Village. See you later. Alright, never have to help him again. That's right, he can suffer. Tired. That's a big ass bitch. How do they make them that big? Food. Like it's got to be inconvenient being that large, right? Like how does he get around? You oh, can't go in Goron Village. Him. I guess it's not our problem anymore. <laughs> He's fucking toast. Guess so. Got him. Oh, fuck that sign. I didn't think you could just blow up the sign with your fist, Jesus. That's sick. Get him. Hell yeah. I wonder if it's oh. even possible to... Oh! Oh! Okay, well that wasn't too bad. I wonder if it's even possible to, like, Goron roll through the wind. Through the wind? No. Like, speedrunner attack? Or no, anything? it'll blow you off to the side. That bridge is so small intentionally to throw you off. Oh yeah, I remember... The reward for the straight fairies for this dungeon is shit. Oh? Yeah, it's really bad. But we can still get it. Sure, why not? Find the fairies that match our color and then bring them back. Also, take this healing. Okay, Aha. it's the end of the second day. Yeah. Uh, so this is the, the start of the dungeon. So if you wanted to reset, we can reset here. I want it, so... But we can just go in and, and fuck around a little bit. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go in and, uh, get the lay of the land, figure out how shit works. Yeah, I mean, you gotta, we're only halfway. You got a day and a half. Because this is the, oh, yeah, this is right. the end of the day of the second day, so we have a full, we are only halfway. God damn it. You can spike rule through those. Yeah, I know. Problem is that. Oh, fuck. The doing. I th it's a good thing you went in that cave, otherwise it would have spawned you next to the, uh, the owl statue. Yeah, ain't no throttle on this bitch. Yeah, I'm not gonna go on roll up. I this. wouldn't, no. I know it's probably possible, but I don't have any sort of... It's fast, but as they say in the speedrunning community... The fastest what? The... I don't take a shower. Oh, wait, I'm thinking of Smash players. Yes, you are. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, Snowhead Temple. Hmm, this is kind of big. It's going to take more than the average strength to move this thing. We're going to need, like, advanced strength. He's working. He's gaming. Gotcha. 
He's, he's doing it. Nope. Let him cook. Crab? Yep. Crab. Alright. I didn't... We got there. That's right. You've never encountered a block like that before, so that's fair. Snowhead Temple is really interesting to me. This is... And I realize this is a, a curse to say this, so I'm going to preface it with an alternate, which is, I think Snowhead might be one of my favorite temples in Zelda. Oh? However, it's also not the best. I, I think it's it's not because it's the best dungeon. It's because I like the core concept of it. The actual execution, depending on the person, leaves somewhat to be desired. Oh, yeah, that'll work. Yeah, that works. I can't find another way. I'll jank it out. All right. Oh, you should try... Uh, yeah. That never gets old. You should try Goron Link's uh, shield, too. I forgot there was a shield. <laughs> he just assumes the position. He just is just he puts his back down. Unlike all the other shields, Goron Link is like ninety percent invincible while that's down. Cause he's just on his back. Or he's not he's just prone. Oh. Welcome to the dungeon. This is the room that will decide whether or not you hate this dungeon. Yep. Because that's a trick roll you have to do. Oh, thank God I'm immune to lava. Oh, yeah, you're made of rocks. I don't think I hate this dungeon as much as I uh, initially thought I was going. Nah, we haven't even seen the main gimmick of this place. But I think it's neat. But we'll see. We'll see how it plays out. First, you gotta figure out rolling physics. First, I gotta figure out how to roll in a straight line. Paddle. What do you want, Tattle? At slippery places like this, you can curl up as a Goron and roll your way across. Yep. Hey, wow, first try. Second try. Well, yeah, but you didn't Fuck! know that was gonna happen. Yeah. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah. And only- Hey, look, Stray Fairy. They're gonna get a lot more devious now. Prepare some fuckery. I don't know if you can even get that from here. And normally, only normal link can jump? Uh, no, Goron Link can jump, just not as well. I'm pretty sure he j jumps better than Deku Link, though. Deku Link can't jump. That's true. Hey, I got it! Look how tall he is. He's so big. So big. Like, he opens a big chest, he's just like, Ugh. Like, flicks it open with the back of his finger. The map! Nice. nice. Good find. Wow, you you handled that, uh, that trick jump super easy. Good job. It didn't like, seem that hard. That took me a billion fucking tries first time I got here. Oh. Again, granted I was like nine, but still. Yeah, no, he does not jump. I guess not. Is that a stray fairy? Yeah, there's a stray fairy there. This is what I'm talking about. These are these are like gonna get like actually hidden now. There we go. Nice. You know, I was actually uh, we were talking about Gundam before. I was actually watching uh, a little bit of G Gundam. Okay. Apparently, uh, infamously the dub for that show, not very good. Not not very good. Actually, G, G Gundam in general, not very good. I mean, um, it's an older Gundam. It is old, so it's old English dub. Um, but the main character, the, or the guy who did the voice of Domonkashu, the main character, is was like a dude who was doing it as a gig so that he could get into medical school. What? Yeah, he was like getting money. And so he's like, he did it, and then as soon as he got into med school, he stopped voice acting. Which is a bummer, because he's probably one of the better voice actors on that show. Oh, 
damn it. Close. I'm gonna miss this jump, aren't I? Got it. Holy shit, I got it. Easy. Now smash that fucker. Oh. Here we go. Big room. Okay. This is the gimmick, kind of. 